Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play The Lost World Jurassic Park. And when last we left off, I've managed to get to an area I've never been to before, clearing the caves and the forest at night, which has brought me to level 7, an area full of tyrannosaurs. Oh boy, said nobody ever, because tyrannosaurs are no joke. While we're going through this area, to get to the jetty admittedly, we have to also get 10 eggs. You can just imagine how difficult that's going to be when you're dealing with Tyrannosaurs. We have the same amount of equipment as we always have, 20 shots with a pistol and 10 grenades. So let's be very careful with our exploration and presume that the baby Tyrannosaurs are going to hurt us and that the adult Tyrannosaurs are going to hurt us a lot. So we're going to have to be very careful. And yes indeed, the baby Tyrannosaurs do hurt us, and that is an adult one right there. Can I get a uh, good um, hit here? No, it would seem not. If I... Uh, there we go. If I get rid of the crate, I can get rid of the baby Tyrannosaur as well. Now, if we run past this, will we get hurt? The answer is no. And that's good to know. Let's uh, try our best to stay away from that, though. And this has a very set path, which I'm very happy for, and keep going this way. No Tyrannosaurs here. There's an egg, which is good, the first of ten. And you make a return! Okay, we can deal with you because we have the pistol. And fortunately, you flinch when uh, we shoot you with it, which means we can avoid taking damage if I'm fast enough with aiming. That is a big if. Alright, let's go over here and go this way. Be ready to run, because nope, there isn't a, a T-Rex here, though there is you. I was half expecting a T-Rex. And we can literally point the uh, pistol at the dinosaur's head and make the attacks there. Now there is a... Uh, there's you there. Okay, if I get you on screen and then try throwing some grenades, will this work? So do you want me to find out? One... Two, three. Aha! It does work! Excellent! We can uh, deal with enemies with explosions that occur off screen. Good to know! Now there's a box here. I keep punching because I am holding down the attack button to run, and that is why, because T Rexes are about and they are bad news. There is an egg here. I would like that. We are going to go this way and try our best not to uh, attract the attention of the exceptionally dangerous dinosaurs. I'm surprised they're not trying to get us when we go close to the eggs. There are probably going to be some that will do that. There's you there. Let's deal with you. I like the fact that enemies do not uh, reappear when you get rid of them, so clearing out enemies is actually a really good idea. Oh, and there's you. Okay, let's uh, be up here and throw a grenade or two. One, two, three. Excellent. You're probably guarding at least one egg. Or at least the way to an egg. There's an enemy there. There's an egg! Okay, we want that, so I don't want to throw a grenade at the wall. That was uh, really wasteful. Let's go up here and see about getting that egg. Switch to this, quickly shoot the dinosaur, and get the health and the egg! Now, I don't want to explore that way right away because uh, there's an area down here and the game is pointing me this way towards another egg, which tells me that uh, I want to get this one first. Now, is there going to be a Tyrannosaurus here? Probably! And I'm very, very wary of uh, facing that Tyrannosaur. No? Yes, I saw it right there, so let's quickly move past it if we can. Where did it go? Do I really want to stay this close to the left side of the screen? Okay, it disappeared. This suits me just fine. Oh, that it suits me just fine. Okay, you're there. And you uh, managed to spit, but you weren't able to uh, get me. And there we go. We're actually running out of uh, pistol bullets here. What's over here apart from more dinosaurs and more peril? There's going to be peril everywhere, to be fair. Because Tyrannosaurs. Okay, up here apparently is an egg. I'll take it. If I can reach it, of course. There's the egg. 
we've got half of them. Is that one over there as well? No, it isn't. So let's keep going and try and find those final ones. There's one down here, apparently. And there's something up here that I probably want. Well, there's an uh, enemy there. I actually have enough grenades that uh, throwing a grenade is probably a better idea. There we go. What's up here apart from loot? Nothing, but the loot is pretty good because those are pistol bullets. Now, there's an egg over here that I want to get, and nothing's guarding it, which is nice. And the game is now pointing me down. Don't want to go down right now, though. I want to be... Oh, okay. They hurt. That's what they do. They uh, hit you with their tail. I'm surprised they don't bite you, and they hurt. Let's just get past you, shall we? And jump over to here. Health? No grenades! Uh, unfortunately, grenades will not patch up my injuries. And we are here now. Okay. There's an egg over there, apparently. And, uh, let's just, uh, deal with you. And head this way to be methodical. Grenades? Won't say no to them. Tinier Tyrannosaur? Will say no to that. And we'll just take care of you carry on this way, and find an egg! Marvellous. Now, there's apparently an egg over here somewhere. And we took a tiny bit of damage, but it really was only a tiny bit of damage. I'm a little concerned that I'm at the very bottom of the level when I really don't- Ooh, when I really don't want to be because enemies. Right, if I throw this high up, can I get it there? No. We're gonna have to, uh, get past you, aren't we? Yes, we are. Running jump, James! And quickly, there we go. This should be fine. We'll just, uh, throw these grenades. One, two, and I think that missed, actually. I think that missed, too. James, stop throwing them too far. There we go, that's better. There's a massive crater off this, uh, small drop where, uh, James kept throwing the grenades a little too hard. But that's okay. We have plenty of grenades, and we're not going to be using a grenade here, though I will have to uh, start switching to them soon enough, because I only have six bullets left. Unless these are bullets. They're bullets! Aha! It's like the game knew that I needed them. Okay, get past you. Seeing uh, bits of work dock is uh, reassuring, because that means we're getting closer to uh, the end. Although I imagine Biosyn are really going to stop us from uh, escaping with all the stuff that we found. Okay, the game is pointing us this way, up a bit. We can get up. One more shot. There we go. Is the egg in easy reach? Or is it above me? It looks like it's above me. Hmm. That's not so good. We're approaching a, a series of waterfalls, and more bullets is always nice. And there is a ledge here. Can I grab this ledge? This could be a big no, because this is looking quite difficult to reach. Oh, this is looking really difficult to reach. How do you grab this? Do you have to be in a really particular spot and then do a running jump? Okay, I have no idea how you're meant to grab that there, but uh, I think there is another way that we can uh, go up. So let's ignore that and instead go the other way, because uh, there was a ledge that uh, we used to get here that uh, we can surely use to get back. At least I hope we can get back, and this is when the game finally introduces a level where you have to do it in a particular order, otherwise you're doomed. Now we just need to keep jumping up so that we can find the uh, ledge in question, because it probably won't be obvious from here. Not here here either. We just need to uh, jump up to here. Not there. It was there. Okay. So, if we jump up here. Oh, this jump's gonna have to be very particular as well, isn't it? How are we gonna get to this one? Hip. There we go. We made it. Now we gotta jump to this one. And then up to here. And do a bit of backtracking. 
I'd rather do that than try and uh, navigate that extremely difficult jump, because that jump looked really hard. And this leads to here, which is bringing us closer to where that egg is. We got here hurt a uh, tiny amount. Only a really tiny amount. I don't actually know if it actually dealt damage. No, it looks like it dealt a smidgen of damage. So, this is the way we want to go. To the right. There's gonna be trouble here, isn't there? Oh, there's- Oh! And they can bite! They don't do as much damage as I thought they would, though. So, if we go this way, and keep going this way, and be mindful of any, uh, Tyrannosaurs. There's one. Let's, uh, avoid you. This is a new area. Or rather, an area I haven't explored thoroughly. Let's, uh, get these boxes, shall we? This has health. Won't say no to that. And this has... Pistol bullets. Also won't say no to that. Brilliant. Let's, uh, jump up here, and it looks like we're gonna have to take the long way around, but I can, uh, deal with that. And this is when we can't deal with that, and we die. A box? Is this actually a way to an egg, or is this just uh, a long-winded route to goodies? I'm starting to get a bit worried it's a long-winded route to goodies. No, actually, I think this will lead to the egg. There's a Tyrannosaur here we can avoid. Aha! Egg. Now, the last egg is beneath us. Let's be careful. There's a waterfall here, and there's you. Okay, let's uh, just get close to you and throw these. Is the final egg over here? Aha! It is! Level complete! One more to go. Receiving message from employer. Your mission is almost over. You need to find a boat to take you off the island. Sounds good. The enemy have taken over the jetty, and are using it to ship out young dinosaurs in cages. That sounds not so good. As soon as you are safely off the island, we will destroy it completely. Destroy it? How? But before you leave, you must find ten more dino eggs. Must I really? If you bring us these last ten eggs, I promise we will never ask for another egg again. You'd better mean that! Talk to you again on the way home. End of message. One more mission! Escape from the island, and there's the password. Oh, this has unique music! This is definitely a boss level. I wonder if we're actually going to fight a boss at the very end. There is health here! I'm a little worried about the fact that there is health here. Oh, there's water as well! Oh, the game is uh, not pulling any punches, and there's an egg right there I cannot reach. Okay! Game is being mean here. Let's see if we can... Oh, there's a Biosyn here. Not surprising, considering they've taken over the uh, jetty, so let's see if we can uh, get more eggs. There's an egg here. There are more eggs over here, though. A second egg there, and now we need to go into the water. Okay, let's see what we can do, James. Into the water we go, and we want to go this way. We'll avoid you, as best we can, anyway. Contact with you doesn't seem to uh, deal damage, it's only the harpoons that you fire. Speaking of harpoons, we'll take some of them, and carry on this way. Hopefully the game is going to be uh, generous with health pickups, because if not, this is really going to be a tricky one. Okay, is there a dinosaur egg here? There is! Good. Let's go over here, and see if there's another dinosaur egg. Nope, there is a Biosyn uh, smuggler. Have at the- oh, you managed to get a uh, shot off. That's okay, you still haven't learned to crouch. 
There should be some more eggs here. Yep, there's an egg right here. And there may even be another one for... Ooh. There's a boat. And another boat. Okay, we're not going to be using that boat. Ooh, okay, you have a gun. That is not good. Don't like the fact that you have a gun. Uh, can we deal with that? Maybe if we throw a bit further? One. Two! Aha! Two grenades will do it. Don't worry, dinosaurs! We'll... kind of free you. I say kind of because we're going to blow this island up. I imagine you'll be fine. Punch! 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 Aha! There's an egg somewhere nearby. Right there. Good! We can jump up to here, grab this egg, and keep going this way. I wonder if this is a very... well... We've discovered that uh, the uh, explosion radius will take out the Biosyn person there. I wonder if uh, this is a very linear level. It certainly seems it so far. Oh, not as linear as I'd wanted to be. Let's uh, go over here quickly. More harpoons. We want to head up primarily, so let's stay here and see if we can find a way up. A way up? No, not yet. Aha! Way up. That's what we want. Up here, to get these boxes. Hopefully one of these contains health. Yes, it does. The game is still being generous in that regard. And I like that. There's another egg up here, apparently. The game is being a little bit lazy with the egg placement, I've noticed. Just, uh, throwing eggs in uh, large groups. I mean, I'm not going to complain about eggs being uh, very obvious. Okay, we've dealt with you before, so if we do this... And just throw grenades, like that, you are gone. There should be at least one more egg nearby. At least I hope. Don't want to go back into the water if I can avoid it. Is there an egg here? Well, there's you! We could deal with you like that and uh, get more health than we lost. And we still need to head to the left. Alright, game, I can do that. Are you sure we need to head to the left? That seems wrong. That seems wrong because of that. Okay, we don't need to head that way because uh, the game has now pointed me in the direction of a different egg. Okay, so uh, when you said you wanted me to go this way, you were actually uh, not being entirely truthful. We want to go... Down here, I imagine. Game's still pointing me in this direction. Not that way, though. We're gonna have to keep going this way, aren't we? And over here. Running out of health, very slowly but surely. I'm a little concerned about that. Two eggs left to get. Who wants to bet that the final egg is going to be uh, held by the boss of the game? If there, in fact, is a boss, I'm going to presume that there is. And we just fired a harpoon there completely needlessly. So, this way leads to... here. Which is a place you've already been to. And the water, which... Was it the beginning of the level? Yes, this water's at the beginning of the level, so I think we now actually want to go this way. But how far this way is the question. I don't like that uh, this way has lots of these eels, which will get us into a lot of trouble. We're slowly running out of health. It is slowly ticking away, and we just lost a little more health there. Okay, this leads up. We've been up before. And I don't think this way is going to... Nope. We need to head even further to the right, don't we? Yes, we do. Alright, let's uh, be very quick about this, James. Oh, this is a very narrow passage where we are going to uh, get into trouble by going down. Or maybe not. We are running low on health, though. I shouldn't have uh, used that uh, health pickup at the very beginning. But if we're lucky... Well, that's not quite what I wanted. I was about to say, if we're lucky, we will get a health pickup once we get to the surface. 
if we get to the surface is probably more accurate. Aha! The surface. Health, please? No. No, it wasn't. But we can get health like that. That's really not a lot of health, though. That's really not a lot. Health. Oh. Yep, definitely gonna use the pistol here. Want this health. Also, want this health, please. Woohoo! Big amount of health! Won't say no to that. Will say no to getting shot, though. One egg is left, and I bet it's being held by the boss. Or, we just need to, uh, get this egg, and then... What after that? The answer is we just get away! Aha! No boss! Goodbye, island! That was a load bearing uh, egg collection, clearly. The island is gone! And we really, really need to sort out our hair as we boat away! Into the sunset. The end. Well done, James! You managed to survive the island, and recover all of those eggs for that mysterious shady employer of yours that we never truly discovered the uh, intentions of. I'm just gonna say that they were good, and uh, we handed over the eggs, and everything was fine, we got a big pile of money, and then we retired on an island that didn't have lots of dinosaurs on it. That sounds good to me! And with that, the game is over! And that was a really, really, uh, good game. The levels beyond uh, the fifth level, the uh, caves, really had an extra element of challenge to them. The final level's challenge really came from the water. The eggs were not really so much of a problem. I was expecting a boss fight, though. I was expecting, like, the leader of the, uh, the smugglers to confront us, and then we'd have a one-on-one -on -one duel, but uh, that didn't happen. And with there being no options for difficulty, it's not hidden behind any uh, hard mode, unless the game uh, reveals a hard mode to you by completing it, but uh, it didn't seem to there. So the ending was a tiny bit disappointing in that there wasn't a big uh, showdown, but considering all that James went through, I don't think he's going to complain. The game really took me by surprise when I first played it with uh, its tone and the way it plays, because uh, back then I hadn't played many games like that, and uh, it really did stick in my memory, and I'm really glad it did, because returning to it has reaffirmed to me how good a game this is. It's quite short, uh, you can complete it very quickly if you know what you're doing, but that doesn't mean it's not a good game. The Game Boy tended to have games that were very short, and uh, they did what they could with the amount of game that they had, and this game does some really neat things. The uh, ammo conservation that you need to engage with in the later levels, the beginning levels give you loads of ammunition, but uh, even when you're in the lab you have to be careful with uh, when you decide to use your weaponry, and uh, navigating around in an efficient manner through the levels, and uh, making sure you don't use all of your pickups. That said, you don't know what's in the pickup, so there's an element of uh, trial and error about it. You go through a level the first few times, die, figuring out where the uh, things you want to keep are and where the enemies are, and slowly but surely you work your way through. This game really did try to do something different, and I commend it for uh, achieving that. If I were to change a few things, I believe a little bit more variety in the weapons would have been good, uh, a few different enemy types as well, especially with the smugglers. We only really encountered a few different types, and they weren't especially dangerous. The uh, environmental hazards were actually more perilous than most of the foes, though the foes did succeed in whittling you down. As for the music, some of these tracks have stuck in my memory for so many years, because they have such a wonderful atmosphere about them. And generally, I, I really like this game. I wish it was longer. A, a couple more stages would have been really nice. A final confrontation, or uh, going onto the boat that the uh, smugglers were using to uh, smuggle the dinosaurs away, and uh, freeing the dinosaurs. That would have been nice, but what we have is still great. And so, that's the end of The Lost World Jurassic Park. What's to come after this? Who can say? 
all I will say is, it's not going to involve as many dinosaurs. Or will it? Seriously, there are a lot of games out there that have dinosaurs in some form or another. Even if it's just a throwaway enemy, you're going through a level and suddenly dinosaurs! Why? Why not? Dinosaurs really succeed in capturing the imagination of people. And Jurassic Park certainly took that and ran with it. And they made some really good games along the way, like this one. If you like platformers with a little bit of a difference, I thoroughly recommend you give this one a try. And so, I'm Kikoskia, and that was The Lost World Jurassic Park for the Game Boy! What's next? Who can say? But it will be an adventure all its own, much like the adventure James just went on. And now James can rest. Trust me, he's earned it. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later. Also, if you see a T-Rex in real life, don't just try and run past it. Trust me, it's going to outrun you. The T-Rexes in this game are not an accurate representation of what they were like in real life, by any stretch of the imagination. As far as we know. There's still a lot of things that we're figuring out about dinosaurs even now. Up until recently, we believed that they uh, didn't have feathers, and now we believe that all of them did. And who knows what discoveries will come in the future. All I know is, I'm going to be looking forward to them, because dinosaurs are awesome! Later.